My name is Naja, and I've never fried pork chops. But we gonna try it in the air fryer today, dog. another video so as you can tell we're in the kitchen finna fry up these pork chops in the air fryer y'all since i don't have this air fryer i've been wanting to try so many recipes and i've been so inspired so i'm just like okay jesus this is a very good investment for your girl i've never made pork chops on the stove before like my mom usually makes all that stuff but i saw a recipe today from smoking and grilling with ab i will leave the link to his video down below I'm gonna follow it to the tizzy and then we gonna see how they come out. So come along with me. Okay, so of course you're gonna go in and clean your pork chops because who takes the meat out without cleaning it? Like not up in this house. <laughs> After that, you're going to use whatever seasonings that you want of your choice. I'm using just some garlic powder, black pepper, pink Himalayan sea salt. After that, I'm going to, I guess, baste them, if you will, in a little bit of buttermilk. And then after that, I'm going to batter them up with a little bit of all-purpose flour. So, let's get cooking. Now he did 390 for 15 minutes. I already started cleaning up. I'm getting ready to clean up this little mess right here because we clean up as we go around these parts. Okay. All right. It's been 15 whole minutes. So we're getting ready to see what these look like. I'm just waiting for it to beep any minute now. There we go. They looking like they frying up pretty nicely and you know what i forgot to do so i'm gonna just do right now even though i do have to flip them over i forgot to um spray them and this is just some um, cooking spray that i got from my local costco's now i'm gonna turn these babies over oh hold up because i'm about to burn myself <laughs> all right um yeah oh But they're looking real nice, tender, with exception of my little, that little patch right there. <laughs> now, AB, he did it the other side for 10 minutes. So I'm going to just go ahead on and cook it for another 10 minutes. Put it back on 390. But I'm just going to cut the time down. But I will check it in about five minutes just to see 
what's what. And child, I forgot to spray the other side. Ugh, I need to get my life. <laughs> All right, there we go. Resume. Okay, five minutes time check. And yes, they better cook to a nice golden crisp. I'm gonna let these finish out these last five minutes and then we gonna eat. All right, we on the last minute. So I'm definitely looking forward to seeing what this tastes like. In the meantime, these are my sides. I made um, some zucchini, squash, fresh mushrooms, and a, I cut up a little onion. Um, stir fried that with some different spices and oh and some fresh garlic and then I have some like I don't know I guess you could say stir fried potatoes you know I'm trying to get a little fancy with it okay <laughs> so yeah this is getting ready to go off in about I guess maybe 20 more seconds so let's see do do Here's the moment we've all been waiting for. Ooh! Yes, Lord. I can give me a little shout in real quick. Let me see if I can come into the light. Oh, my goodness. Do y'all see? Do you see what I see? <laughs> Now y'all know that's a shame I'm excited over some food, but I'm hot. Lunch is prepared and now it's time for the moment of truth. Ready, set, go. Mmm. Nicely seasoned, well done. And I'm gonna show you like a, let me see if I can get a up close picture. That tastes real good. Like, let me see if I can, I'm gonna turn the camera around. Okay, so this is what it looks like, like all the way close up. You can see that this is so juicy and just tender and scrunchy. So we've come to the end of this video. I did the whole process with you. I did the taste test. Now we finna just devour <laughs> this meal. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see y'all on the next video. I'm not sure what I'll do next, but I'm thinking fried chicken. So y'all gonna wanna stay tuned. Bye. I'm still eating. Mmm. It is so good. Like, mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Maybe I should do like a mukbang next time I make something. Mmm, we shall see about these potatoes and these fresh vegetables. Mm, what restaurant? I got one right up in this kitchen. Okay. Hey guys, we get it. It was good. But girl, there is nothing.